So we are just stopped by the police, just want money, it's so funny. Really, really funny, guys. Is Abuja better than Lagos? Welcome to Abuja! The capital of Nigeria is Abuja. And it's often forgotten when people visit Nigeria. Because Lagos is by far the biggest city. Lagos! Abuja became Nigeria's capital city in 1991. One nation. And it's the most structured city. And it's located in the middle of the country. It was chosen because of the fact that it's centrally located in the part of the country which was underdeveloped before. Abuja. Sumarak. This is the Usman Dam here, close to Abuja in the center of Nigeria. So even though it's in the center, there are still water options here in the capital of Nigeria. Here are some interesting facts to satisfy your curiosity about Abuja and Nigeria. What is this behind you? National church in Abuja. So police just pulled up on us with big machine guns, everything said we didn't have the permission to go to this place in Abuja and I had to pay them like five dollars. They were very consistent and very annoying to be honest. It's a shame because the Nigerian people are super awesome, but there are always these devils in uniform when they see a white guy, unfortunately. Money hungry guys, unfortunately, who comes and say you need this, you need this, you need this. Yeah, what can you do? Just to tell you guys. We just stopped by the police, so we just want money. So I don't know if I did not follow them like that. I only have 1,000. Just give them 2,000. Thank you so much for your guidance and to keep everyone safe, sir. Abuja is calm, very calm, a little bit conservative, less traffic of course. Lagos has about 25 million people, Why Abuja is about 5 million. Abuja is about one fifth of Lagos population. Also, another difference between Lagos and Abuja is Abuja has more mountains surrounding the city, whereas Lagos is a harbor city, you don't have the water close to Abuja the same way as they have in Lagos. But it's really beautiful scenery here in Abuja, the mountains are everywhere. It's pretty cool. Sumarak! in the city of Abuja. Woo! And I also love Nigeria, so... <laughs> Nigeria is a country full of happy people. But we have all mixed together. We love each other. We eat each, uh, each people food. Yeah. We have love to every one of us here. Mm -hmm. We are friendly to That's each right. other. That's so right. there is no problem at all. Nigerian Toro. I had myself some Nigerian breakfast before I was ready to leave the big city Lagos to go to the capital Abuja. So what is the difference between Lagos and Abuja? Lagos is actually very, it's fast, it's fast paced, vibrant, it's quick, you know, and everybody is in your face. Um, in my opinion, Abuja is quite laid back, um, <laughs> can make you very complacent, <laughs> maybe. So I think, I think that is it, you know. The, the traffic situation in Lagos make you wake up early, make you get back home late, and so your brain is active all the time. <laughs> I really enjoy this city actually. A lot of energy. Lagos is the biggest English speaking city in the whole world. Around 25 million people. That guy, he got a little mad. I like your style. Thank you. You look like the big man. <laughs> Baba. Would you take that to Denmark? Take me to Denmark now. I take it to Denmark now? Yes. Then you have to marry me. You marry all of us. Wow! I'm the big, I'm the big man. The big man. You are big man. Big man. Big man. No problem. No problem. Oh, she doesn't like it. She doesn't like you. At least I have you. Have a good day, guys. Bye bye. Abuja has a better road system, road network than Lagos. Well, there's more money in Lagos. It's a commercial city. Just like New York. I like Abuja, I used to in Lagos, uh, but I left Lagos because of too much traffic, pollution, population, bad road. I couldn't deal with it, so I moved to Abuja. This is Lagos! Beautiful stuff in Lagos, so many stuff happening. I like Abuja, it's calm, it's nice. There's not a lot to do in Abuja, like Lagos, there are tons of places to visit. You think I'm joking? Oh I'm not joking, my nigga. Ah, oh, my boy. We're together. Nah, We're together. Look. See you guys, yes, sir. Have a good day. You know, in Nigeria, you still have bad people and you have good people. Okay, guys, now it's time to fly from Lagos to the capital of Nigeria, Abuja. I'm flying with Green Africa Airways. My first time trying this airline. Really excited to see what that is like. It's a very new airline from 2015, I think. I know many people, they don't go there, but I'm curious to see the capital also. Now I'm finally in the country with the best music in the world, Nigeria, and this is the airport ship. Yeah? I'm looking for maybe a cable or something. I already have two girlfriends out here. Take them. Denmark. Denmark. 
You're going to Abuja now or something? Yeah. How is the airline? Uh, it's quite good. It's good. Relatively new? Yeah. And you have flown with them before? Yeah, I've flown with them. I just came from... Uh, Which one do you prefer, Abuja or later? I really prefer Abuja. Alright. Yeah. With my new friend here, we are going to Abuja. Is it your hometown? Yeah, yeah. Oh, cool man. I'm excited to see it. A-Town, Abuja. So, your name? Gustav. 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 You can call me Whiskey. Okay, yeah. Whiskey. Whiskey. Call me Stabo. Thank you. Stabo. Stabo, yeah. This one. Move your band from your body. I want to freeze. I'm easy to find. You told me you were in a green shirt. Yeah, I like Uber here in Nigeria. It's very easy. Really good guy here in Abuja. Thank you for taking me to my place. <laughs> One thing that I really love about Nigeria is that everyone speaks English. Yes, they speak Pidgin, but everyone can understand when you speak to them. And after having traveled around West Africa, it's mostly French in many countries. I can navigate a bit in French, but it's just really nice for me to be able to speak with everyone, no matter their social status, no matter where they're from in Nigeria. So that's one thing I really appreciate about the country that it's so easy to come here as a traveler to just have a really nice time with the people and they have a great sense of humor they have a great understanding of what you say you don't need to simplify things a really big plus of nigeria in my opinion you can always take a, an hour flight to lagos or go by road which is 12 hours i do both oh you need good footwork huh? a little off road in nigeria look at this chilly spot guys this is definitely the wet side of abuja yeah. so people come here and chill out people come here and chill out so it's time to climb this one, difficult hill of Abuja. Let's go. Easy kill. I would say the air pollution is definitely better here. Yeah, yeah. Than it is in Lagos, where it's, in Lagos. it's not so good. <laughs> yeah, a lot of air pollution. Look at this road, guys. I already had a few compliments for my outfit. A really great start. Two girls said I look beautiful. And here we have a Real Madrid fan. Hello Madrid. Nice shirt, bro. Who's the best player for Real Madrid? Vinicius. No, you like Vinicius also? Yeah. That's great, man. Wow, you're looking nice, Africa. Looking fresh, huh? Yeah, it's nice. Yeah, nice guy. You can even win some fancy cars in Abuja. This is Nigeria. Abuja is probably one of the most organized cities I've seen in West Africa, if not the most organized. Very clean, very structured, like the roads are in really good condition in most places. Fancy hotels. So yeah, very impressed by the capital.